Here we are. He's coming. He, look, he's, he's ready to go. So give him a big warm welcome, everyone. Dave Ashley. Can you all see that okay? See a, see a jet in front of me. Oh, Very yes. Exciting. That's what we like, isn't it? And nice to meet you. I'm Dave Ashley, if you've not met you before. Uh, I'm going to start with a video because always start with a, a, a video to make everybody happy. It might be quite loud. <coughs> So there we go, that was what I used to do, which was quite an interesting job, just to get you all waking up. Uh, so I used to fly the Harrier, which is a sort of jump jet, which is great fun. Did that for about 18 years, so six years on the Harrier, flew the F-18 in Canada, which is fabulous, where, so on uh, a lot of combat operations on the Harrier, some maniacs flew some airplanes into buildings, which kind of put a damper on most of what I was doing at the time. Uh, got married, had kids, got bored of being shot at, went to Canada, flew the F-18, which was great, then left the military, went to Saudi Arabia, uh, flew the, the, the Hawk, which is the Red Arrows jet, and then I do a bit of consulting, occasionally flying uh, things like the F-16 at the moment, which is great. Uh, I've been on board boats, which is great, uh, some people be upset, a bit of operations as discussed, uh, hung out with guys with lots of big guns, which is always very interesting, uh, went to Key West, fought the Americans, and then did a bit of air-to-air -air refueling as well. So just some pretty pictures, just a bit, a bit different really is what I used to do. Uh, I then decided madly to go and join the airlines. So <laughs> I went to Jet2, fabulous company. I'll never put them down, they're really good. Uh, lovely people, very pro uh, ex-military guys, etc. but it just bored me to tears basically. So I left that within day one of ground school of airline training. I think I've made a mistake here. So. I, uh, I left that and then moved on to uh, back to the Middle East. So I was in Qatar. That's me on the bike going off a dune way too quickly. Uh, I landed at the bottom of the dune rather than halfway down it and then uh, herniated a disc in my back, uh, which then I thought, hang on a minute, can I keep flying these fighter jets forever? Uh, so it was a, a, a moment in my life which changed it really. So I set up Ashley Property Group. So uh, a property company and we do all sorts, which I'll go into shortly. Uh, luckily I set up about a year after I set up my property company, I was involved in a mid-air collision. Uh, my wingman took my wingtip off and the aeroplane obviously goes wildly out of control with it when it's missing a big chunk of wing. So it went from calm to this isn't going very well really quickly, uh, ejected, broke my back on the way out, uh, nearly lost my right eye. Uh, so it was all quite emotional. Impact of the desert at a high speed, if you've done any parachuting you know that the parachutes they put into ejection seats are really small. So. Uh, thought I'd broken my ankle and my hip, but I, I lived, so there we go, happy days. Every cloud's got a silver lining. So we then moved back to the UK, uh, and we moved to lovely Dorset, as you can see in the middle. And I've been doing a lot of physical activity to get fit again, so I ran a half marathon last weekend. So Lex, thank you for putting on the video show, advertising this talk. Uh, it was a half marathon, I apologise for the artistic licence of the marathon. But yeah, so that's coming on great, and I met all you lovely people here on the TPN on the left there. So I'm married, two kids, two dogs, uh, 15, uh, 13 and 11 year old boys, so never a dull moment. What do we do? Ashley Property Group, I've got about four minutes left, so there we go. We do portfolio building for ourselves and also clients. We've got a lot of overseas clients from Canada through to uh, Japan area, Hong Kong, down to South Africa. Obviously we were overseas, so a lot of overseas clients. What do we do if you're short of time or you don't know where to start, you don't want the hassle? then we can build a property portfolio for you. We've got repeat customers, so we've got people onto their fourth, fifth property with us now. Uh, we'll source the property, we can refurb the property, we can provide the solicitors, the accountants, the mortgage brokers. So it's basically a complete hands-off uh, service if you want it. Obviously, we've got a big power team. We deal all over the country. So we have uh, people 
all over the place. We generally do Northern England and Scotland for like buy to lets because the uh, returns are so good. And then there's HMOs. We're starting land developments uh, and we'll utilize the best professionals within that. Here's a quick example of one we, one we did earlier. So we bought a property, a two bedroom flat for 22,000 pounds. Yeah, that's right, 22,000 pounds for a two bedroom flat. In Scotland, uh, that was below market value by nearly 30%. We refurbished it for 11 grand. So total investment, 34 grand. Cash flow, 352, not huge, but if you've got a few of them, it comes on quickly, but the yield on that, 23%. Revalued, 50 grand. So when we refinanced it, it reduces the cash flow slightly, but we got the cash out from the refinance was more than we put in. So actually we got a free two bedroom apartment, which is being rented out continuously. Uh, and it'll be a, a free asset producing income forever. So that's going to one of my children. So we kept that one because it was so good. Uh, and that's what it looked like before. I like the curtains, uh, but unfortunately they had to go. So we replaced those and refurbished it and away we went. So that's the, one of those bad boys. So that was a quick turnaround. Uh, and there's someone in there. Flips, we do flips, quick video, because you're probably getting bored of my voice. So we obviously we buy properties and then we refurbish them and then we sell them. So we do that as well. And then there's also things, house of multiple occupation. So you think of uh, the young ones, uh, students in bedsits, that's all changed. So we do high end uh, refurbishment. So this one, for example, really quickly, figure's not very interesting, but 80 grand rents out for 2,400 pounds a month. Pretty good. Annual cash flow after refinancing, obviously you lose a bit, 12 and a half. Increase in value because we refurbished it, get 60 grand out, money left in the deal, only 19 grand. Your return on capital employed is 65%. Pretty good, I think. So that's HMOs, we're doing some of those. Land and new build, we've got a whole load of these on the go. So if you're interested in, in getting involved, then please let me know. And this one is a uh, 69 unit build in Scotland, which we're just going through the planning at the moment. So hopefully that'll be coming up soon. So that's gonna be uh, flats and a couple of big houses for that one. Uh, we've got a few of those on the go. So we do a mixed bag of things really. So to sum up, I think I've got about uh, a minute left, I think. So there we go, yeah, about 30 seconds. We've got different options for any property investment needs. We've got quite a large network throughout the country and global reach. Uh, if you are selling a home, if you know anybody selling a home or land, uh, we're looking for old care homes, pubs, Commercial to residential options, I think are gonna, gonna be high. Uh, we can help you make money through uh, property. If you are interested, please give me a shout. Any questions, that's me. Thank you very much. Very well done, Dave. And um, do, do we call you Goose or Maverick then? I wouldn't be Goose, he's the guy who sat in the back. 